This is the government primary school of Modhera village, about 100 kilometers from Ahmedabad. Like most rural schools in India, the overall facility seem basic from the outside. But as you walk into the classrooms, you're pleasantly surprised. Almost every one of them is equipped with projectors and digital boards. Children are learning maths concepts with the help of digital learning tools and engaging with visual stories that were otherwise available only as textbooks. And all this has been possible ever since the school was powered with solar energy. Six months ago, this remote village school transformed into a digital learning hub after the Gujarat state government installed solar panels on its rooftop. This was part of a unique solarization initiative for Modhera. As a teacher, we have seen this benefit that before we had our digital classroom, we couldn't use so much of it as much as we were doing the solar plates. As much as we were doing it, we could use it as much as we were doing it. And the bill of electricity bill और बिजली के बिल की इतनी चिंता नहीं होती, तो ये अच्छा बेनिफिट है कि उनको जो चाहे तब तक लगातार 11 से 5 तक हम बढ़ा सकते हैं। The school isn't the only one reaping the benefits of solar energy. The entire village of Modhera gets its electricity supply from solar panels installed on their rooftops, making it the first and perhaps the only village in India that is 100% solar powered. From the village, bus station to residential homes, every building in Modhera operates on solar energy. Even the historic Modhera Sun Temple that the village is known for is now lit up every evening thanks to the new source of renewable energy. This uninterrupted supply of electricity is generated at this solar plant that's built barely five kilometers away from the village. The plant is equipped with 22,000 solar panels, a smart battery storage system, and state-of-the-art infrastructure that is designed to transmit power to more than 1,800 families in Modhera. The village of Modhera, its energy requirement, we have added the 6-megawatt power plant and 15-megawatt battery energy storage system. So, the requirement of power is the power. We have fulfilled the requirement of the whole energy of Modhera in Modhera. Over the last decade, solar power has been widely promoted across India as a viable form of renewable energy. Experts have even endorsed it as the key to solving India's growing energy crisis. However, outside of industrial use, India hasn't been able to truly harness the power of solar energy for its urban or rural population. If you look at the uh, current uh, requirement uh, for uh, consumers in India, it's about like 400 to 500 uh, gigawatt. And uh, we are not able to meet it through uh, renewable energy, especially uh, since solar is the leading uh, source of energy for us. So we are not able to achieve that uh, target. Electricity rates are going up, it's never coming down. If we are achieving big targets through solar energy, and which we, which we showed actually, uh, so is the common citizen getting relief in his electric, electricity bill? No, he's not getting it. So every year, uh, average, like you know, you can say seven to eight percent increase in electricity bills are happening all over India. The Modhera Village Solar Project was launched in October 2022 as a pilot to solve this problem of access and affordability of electricity for a rural community. At first, only 37 families in this village agreed to set up solar panels. No one believed that it could generate low-cost electricity. For Mahendra Patel and his family, the change of heart happened when they discovered that their neighbour did not have to pay for electricity anymore after installing solar panels. पहले दो ढाई हजार जो आता था उसे वो प्लस माय हो के वो माइनस में अभी आ रहा है सरकार के पास हमारा तीन सौ पांच सौ आठ सौ ऐसे जमा आता है वो सरकार ऐसा चीज बनाया है कि सोलर जी जो हर मार्च एंडिंग में जो पैसा आएगा वो जितना भी बचत हुआ होगा दो सौ पांच सौ हर महीने का ये दो सौ है कोई पांच सौ है गर्मी में कम बचत होता है 
एज सर्दी ऋतु में ज़्यादा बचत होता है तो वही बचत होकर जो हर साल का छः हज़ार आठ हज़ार आता है वो बचत मार्च एंडिंग में सरकार हमारा वो बैंक अकाउंट में जमा कर देती है तो उससे हमको बहुत आराम है This monetary incentive for surplus energy generation made solar power a popular alternative to conventional energy in Modhera. The model is quite simple. Every household would get a free solar panel that could generate around 1 kilowatt of power. This would get added to the supply coming from the main solar plant. Villagers would now have to pay only for the units consumed over and above the energy generated by their own solar panels. and all the unused units are added as credit in the electricity bill zero bill ye hai ki jaise ki wahan un jo consumer hai unko unki requirement hai do units ki aur aur wo produce kar rahe hai daily char units ki to wo hota kya ki per month unhone 120 units ka unhone productions kiya aur unhone sirf use kiya 80 units ka to baki ke jo balance rahe 40 units to wo unke bill mein reflect ho ke unko bill to unko unke bill mein reflect ho ke wo क्रेडिट होता है वो पेमेंट्स उनको तो ये चीज़ हो गई कि ना तो मुझे बिल पे करना है और इवन तो मुझे उसकी बैल का क्रेडिट्स भी मिल रहा है तो जीरो बिल्स मतलब बिल पे करना नहीं आ रहा और मेरा बिल भी जमा हो रहा है 38 ईयर ओल्ड रामिला दर्जी वर्क्स एज अ टेलर एंड एवर सिंस शी मूव टू सोलर पावर शी इज एबल टू वर्क फॉर मोर आवर्स ऑन हर सोइंग मशीन दिस मीन्स हर इनकम हैज ऑल्सो डबल्ड अलॉन्ग साइड द सेविंग्स शी मेक्स ऑन द एनर्जी कंजम्पन मैं मशीन पक से चलाती थी और सोलर आने के बाद मैं इलेक्ट्रिक मशीन लाके मैं वहाँ से काम करती हूँ मोटर से पहले तो दिन में काम करती थी तो दो तीन ब्लाउज बनाती थी और रात को तो नहीं बैठती थी अब सोलर आने से मैं रात को भी दो तीन नंग रात को भी बना लेती ग्यारह बजे तक ग्यारह बारह बजे तक तो मेरे को रोज का हम तो छः सौ सात सौ का काम होता था अब ये सोलर आने से रात को काम करते मेरे को पंद्रह सौ का डूबना काम हो जाता है तो मेरे को काम घर का खर्च करने में मेरे को दिक्कत कोई नहीं आती आराम से घर चलता है हमारा मुधेरा सोलर प्रोजेक्ट इज प्रूविंग टू बी अ गेम चेंजर फॉर रूरल लाइवलीहुड इन मेनी वेज इट हैज आल्सो ब्रॉट डिजिटल टेक्नोलॉजी क्लोजर टू दीज रूरल होम्स दीज स्मार्ट मीटर्स इंस्टॉल्ड आउटसाइड एवरी बिल्डिंग विद अ सोलर पैनल कैन बी ट्रैक्ट रिमोटली एट द सोलर प्लांट इन दिस कंट्रोल रूम व्हिच इज आल्सो कॉल्ड द स्कैडर रूम The engineers are able to monitor all kinds of data that enables them to predict the energy consumption pattern of every individual and also assesses for any power leakage in real time. हर पावर प्लांट को मॉनिटरिंग करने के लिए हम लोगों को एक स्कैडर रूम बनाना पड़ता है कि जिससे हम लोग उसका फॉल्ट आइडेंटिफिकेशन विद इन टाइम पे हम लोग उसको रिजोल्व कर पाएँ तो तो यहाँ पे हम लोग ये जो खड़े हैं यहाँ पे उसको स्कैडर रूम में स्कैडर रूम में हम लोग क्या करते हैं कि जिसे आप पीछे देख सकते हैं कि यहाँ पे जितने रेडिएशन है उसके हिसाब से यहाँ पे जनरेशन होगा उसके जनरेशन होने के बाद में जो आ, जो एनर्जी है आप देखो जो सन टेम्पल का एरिया है वहाँ पे वो एनर्जी गांव में फीड होगी बाकी की जो बैटरी शो हो रही है वहाँ पे बैटरी में एनर्जी स्टोर होगी और बाकी की जो एनर्जी है वो ग्रिड में ट्रांसमिट हो जाएगी इंडिया इज नाउ ऑन इट्स वे टू बिकमिंग द फोर्थ लार्जेस्ट प्रोड्यूसर ऑफ सोलर एनर्जी इन द वर्ल्ड But can this model be scaled across the urban and rural landscape in India? Experts say that the success of such solar-based microgrid projects depend on two key factors. One is how efficiently it can maintain these grids in remote locations, and second, on how effectively they can be connected to empower local communities. What I feel is that microgrid projects are the future of India. wherein that uh, off grid and on grid even there is a talk of like uh, the dc and the ac supply will be kept separate so that there is no loss of power also when we are uh, using uh, only ac part so the, a lot of things are happening in the this uh, sector meanwhile for these school children in modhera solar energy is no longer a distant concept found in their science textbooks They are now able to witness the power of renewable energy on their rooftops. कितना ना घरे सोलर प्लेस लगे इसे हमारा गांव सूर्य मंदिर से तो फेमस है लेकिन भारत का पहला सोलर विलेज होने के कारण हमारा गांव और फेमस हो गया है 
इसलिए मुझे गर्व है कि मैं यहाँ मोडेरा गांव में रहती हूँ थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग इको इंडिया इफ यू लाइक द स्टोरी प्लीज गिव अस अम्स अप एंड सब्सक्राइब टू स्क्रोल डॉट इन ऑन यूट्यूब